hear that? It's the sound of the world waiting. Listening for the next great story. That speechless moment of the next breakthrough. Or reveling in the sounds of a silenced pandemic. With the magnitude of great thinking done through history, man designed a place to create, house, and utilize these thoughts for the benefit of all. Today, we call this institution the university. It's the story of individuals becoming more of the next generation. to see what you make it.
Good afternoon. <laughs> I am Claudia Petrescu, Vice Provost for Graduate Education and Dean of the Graduate School. It is my very great pleasure to welcome you to the Graduate School's Spring 2022 Commencement Ceremony. <laughs> Let's start this great event with the national anthem. Please rise as you are able and join Miss Catherine Westhoven in singing the national anthem. Gentlemen, please remove the motorboards. Please be seated. Now, I would like to introduce the members of the platform party. They are instrumental to the mission of graduate education. Please hold your applause until everybody has been introduced. Platform party, as I read your name, please stand. In the first row, starting at my left, Laurel Littrell, professor and director, K-State Libraries, Amy Button Renz, President and CEO, K-State Alumni Association, Shelley Kiblinger, Regent, Kansas Board of Regents, Richard Linton, President, Kansas State University, Charles Tabor, Provost and Senior Vice President, Kansas State University, General Michelle Letcher, Commencement Speaker, U.S. Army, Katerina Scoglio, Professor, Electrical Engineering, Distinguished Graduate Faculty Recipient, Tucker Graff, Graduate Student Council President, Vincent Carly, Reader for Today's Commencement, Scott Schlender, Reader for Today's Commencement. In the second row, starting at the left, Brandon Haddock, Coordinator, Diversity and Multicultural Student Affairs, Division of Student Life. Karen Peterson, Dean, Global Campus. Jackie Spears, Interim Dean, 
K State Oleta, Bonnie Wash, Dean, College of Veterinary Medicine, Matt O'Caffey, Dean, Carl Ice, College of Engineering, Amit Chakrabauti, Dean, College of Arts and Sciences, Kevin Gwina, Dean, College of Business Administration, Tim De Noble, Dean, College of Architecture, Planning and Design, Craig Harms, Interim Dean, College of Health and Human Sciences, Ernie Minton, Dean, College of Agriculture, Debbie Mercer, College of Education. Please join me in giving our platform party a round of applause. The marshals for today's ceremony are Bradley Benke, Associate Dean, College of Health and Human Sciences, Brett De Paola, Professor and Head, Department of Physics, Martin Draper, Professor and Associate Dean for Research, College of Agriculture, Stacy Hutchinson, Associate Dean, Carl R. Ice, College of Engineering, Terry Mason, Professor and Director, College of Business Administration, Sarah Resnikoff, Interim Associate Dean, Graduate School, Cindy Schumann, Associate Dean, College of Education, Glade Topham, Professor, College of Health and Human Sciences. Please join me again in a round of applause for the marshals. As a research institution, Kansas State University has a responsibility and obligation to provide not only a high quality undergraduate education, but to offer advanced education to students who have the ambition and intellectual curiosity to deepen their knowledge and command of their discipline. As our graduate students know, this pursuit is a demanding, yet invigorating process. I anticipate our graduate students will remember their time in graduate school as I still do remember mine as one of the most exciting times of my career. Many have contributed to you completing your advanced degrees, your family, the friends and colleagues you have made while at K-State and many others. Can we give the family and friends, can we have the family and friends stand up to be acknowledged? And now can we please acknowledge the family and friends with a round of applause. Another important group we need to recognize at this time is the student mentors, the graduate faculty who have worked closely with these graduates and contributed in significant ways to the completion of the studies that we officially recognize today. Graduate faculty, please stand so we can show our appreciation with a round of applause for mentoring these graduates. I would also like the members of the Graduate Student Council to stand and to be recognized. Thank you. Please join me now in welcoming Dr. Charles Tabor, Provost and Executive Vice President of Kansas State University. Good afternoon and welcome. I'm Chuck Tabor, Provost and Executive Vice President of Kansas State University. It's my pleasure to introduce Regent Shalane Kiblinger. Shelley Kiblinger was appointed to the Kansas Board of Regents in 2019. She has chaired the Academic Affairs Committee for the past two years and co-chairs the Advantage Kansas Coordinating Council. Kiblinger recently retired from a career in K-12 public education. From 2017 to 2021, 
She served as superintendent of Cherryvale Public Schools in Montgomery County, Kansas, near the area where she was born and raised. Kiblinger served as the superintendent of Hutchinson Public Schools from 2011 to 2017. She held various leadership positions in Garden City Public Schools from 1999 to 2011, which included high school associate principal, assistant superintendent of curriculum and instruction, and assistant superintendent of personnel. Dr. Kiblinger began her career as a teacher of English language arts. Throughout her career, Kiblinger was a member of numerous boards and committees serving K-12 education and her community, and was twice a finalist for Kansas Superintendent of the Year. Regent Kiblinger graduated with a Doctor of Education in Educational Administration and Leadership from Kansas State University in 2004, earning the Outstanding Graduate Student Award from the College of Education. She earned a Master of Science in Educational Leadership and a Bachelor of Science in Education from Pittsburgh State University. She holds an Associate of Arts degree from Independence Community College. She completed a teaching endorsement for English Speaker of Other Languages from Newman University in 2007. In retirement, Dr. Kiblinger works as a freelance educational consultant to K-12 schools and businesses that serve them. She maintains an emeritus membership in the Kansas School Superintendents Association, volunteers for the Cherryvale Youth Fair, and is a member of the St. Ignatius Catholic Church. She and her husband enjoy traveling and spending time with their nieces and grandchildren. Please join me in welcoming Regent Kiblinger. Thank you. It is an honor to be in Manhattan this afternoon offering a few words of congratulations and advice on behalf of the Board of Regents. The Board has an ambitious strategic plan which includes goals to increase the number of degrees earned and the number of graduates in the talent pipeline. We are closer to our goals today because of all of you. So today, I commend you for the hard work and dedication, the personal sacrifice by you and your families to reach this milestone. And I thank you for the future economic contribution that your talents will make to the local, state, and national economies. For several weeks, I pondered what conventional words of wisdom I should share with you today. But then realizing that people who distinguish themselves in this world often do things a little bit differently than everyone else, I decided instead to offer three pieces of unconventional advice with life-changing potential. Unconventional tip number one, talk to strangers. Now I don't mean the creepy person hanging out in the alley at midnight. Probably best to trust your instincts on that one and run. But talk to strangers you encounter at work, at the gym, in your neighborhood. Talk to them. Get to know them. Ask them about their lives, their opinions, their life experiences. And listen, really listen, and seek to understand the world through their eyes. It's hard to hate another human being when you know his or her story. So talk to strangers and learn from them. Unconventional tip number two, don't be yourself. Don't be yourself because who you are today is not the person that you are capable of being. You can be even more. So don't be yourself. Instead, be the person who does the actions today that will lead you into habits and those habits will eventually grow you into a better version of yourself. So instead of being yourself, push yourself 
each day to be just a little more positive, more generous, more thoughtful, more supportive, more honest in your relationships, and kinder. Don't be yourself. Be your even better future self. And finally, unconventional tip number three. Do something you may regret. Yes, you heard me right. Do something you may regret. Now, I don't mean something that might cause you or another person harm, but don't let fear of the unknown or fear of failure stop you from taking advantage of a rare or once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Most people say they most regret the chances they didn't take. So have the courage to do at least some of the things you may regret, because some of life's greatest rewards are attained by taking a risk. I hope these three bits of unconventional wisdom at least give you pause to think. On behalf of the members of the Kansas Board of Regents, President and CEO Blake Flanders, all of the KBOR staff, I wish you congratulations, best wishes, and no matter what happens in life, remain calm, wabash on, and go cats. At this time, we would like to honor the two faculty who received the Commerce Bank and W.T. Camper Foundation Distinguished Graduate Faculty Award. The Distinguished Graduate Faculty Award is made annually to those faculty who have distinguished themselves nationally and internationally for excellence in research and graduate education. Today we honor professors Katerina Scoglio and Barbara Valent. Dr. Scoglio, will you please join me at the podium? If you just stay next to me. <laughs> As an internationally recognized expert in the field of network science and contact network models for epidemic spreading, Professor Katerina Scoglio's work has been transformational. Her research team developed the generalized epidemic mean field modeling software, which has been widely adopted by other researchers and applied to the modeling of many infectious diseases. Professor Scoglio and her research group are often sought out for research proposals in response to the new epidemics. Her team's work in the last year has been particularly significant as the team produced accurate predictions of the spread of COVID-19 in the Wuhan city, China, and in the Uganda cases of Ebola in 2019. Dr. Scoglio's research has been supported by more than $11 million in funding. She has over 100 journal publications, 73 conference presentations, and she has given over 35 invited talks. In addition to her outstanding accomplishment in research, Dr. Scoglio has made important contributions to graduate education at K-State. She mentored 23 master's students and 18 doctoral students who have been successful in both academia and industry careers in the US and abroad. Dr. Scoglio earned her doctorate in engineering from the University of Rome. She joined K-State Electrical and Computer Engineering Department in 2005. Her work has been recognized with numerous awards, including this one, the Distinguished Graduate Faculty Award. So at this point, I'm going to give you an award. Okay. Congratulations, and thank you for your work. Thank you. The other distinguished graduate faculty is Barbara Valent, who is not able to be with us today. Dr. Valent is an internationally recognized scholar who has made high impact contribution to our understanding on plant diseases 
that threaten global food security. She has spent decades studying fungal diseases. Please read Dr. Vallon's full list of accomplishments and a summary of her work in the online commencement program. Now, I would like to introduce our commencement speaker for today's ceremony, Brigadier General Michelle Letcher, currently serves as the Chief of Staff of the U.S. Army Futures Command, where she is responsible for the modernization of today's military to meet uncertain threats. General Letcher has served with distinction for, distinction for 27 years, where she has commanded units in combat in Iraq and Afghanistan, and also served in the defense of South Korea. She is a native of Oak Forest, Illinois, and was commissioned in the Army to ROTC at Illinois State University in 1995. She holds a Bachelor of Arts degree in social work from Illinois State University and three master degrees, a Master of Science in Human Services and Counseling from the State University of New York College, a Master's in Advanced Military Studies from the Command and General Staff College, and a Master of Arts in National Security in Strategic Studies from K-State University. During General Letcher's distinguished military career, she has received multiple awards of the Legion of Merit, Bronze Star Medal, and the Meritorious Service Medal. General Letcher is married to Colonel Kenneth Letcher, and they have three sons. Please join me in welcoming General Letcher. Thank you, Claudia and President Linton for the kind offer to speak here today. When I arrived and I had dinner the first night, I met with Claudia and Dr. DeGroat, who I think is out here somewhere, and at the end of the evening, Dr. DeGroat said that from my photo, I looked like I was about eight feet tall. So he's expecting a very tall person. And my photo is a headshot, so I'm not exactly sure where he got that from. And that evening, I went home, and I called my son, who's 15, and I was sharing the story, and he said, yeah, Mom, like all my friends expect you to be extremely tall, and then they see you, and they're shocked that you're a little over five feet tall. I will tell you today, I feel 10 feet tall being here with you. And not because I'm on the stage, but I think that we can collectively agree that today we stand on the shoulders of giants, of those who came before us. And it, you know, I am full, full of so much pride and humility for this opportunity. Thanks. Congratulations to the class of 2022. It's an honor to celebrate with you, faculty, family, and most of all, graduates, a phenomenal achievement. I was extremely moved by the invitation professionally, but for me personally, it was that I missed my own commencement ceremony in 2008 when I earned a graduate degree in security studies from Kansas State University. Like many of you, I was working a full-time job, married, two children under the age of three. My husband was also in the program, and when graduation day came, I was preparing to deploy to Iraq in a couple of weeks, so we were unable to attend. So today's honor, in many ways, speaks to how special this institution is in the way it supports their studies, families, and the recognition of our collective achievements. As you heard, my name is Brigadier General Michelle Letcher, and I am proud to be an American soldier, a leader to America's, thank you. Thank you. A leader to America's sons and daughters and humbled to wear the cloth of our nation for over 27 years and a graduate of Kansas State University. And if you, thank you, <laughs> lots of applause. But hold them for one second, if you will, and humor me. By any chance, do we have any currently serving or veterans in the audience? And if we do and you are able, could you please stand up?
Thank you for your service. And when I talk about standing on the shoulders of giants, these are the individuals that, that, that I am proud to call teammates and friends. I was 35 when I received this degree, and I tell people that it was that year that I discovered my true passion for service. Within two months of graduation, I was in Baghdad, Iraq. I arrived on the 4th of July and started to apply this degree in ways that I couldn't have imagined. My boss had asked me to write a strategic plan in concert with a sovereign nation to help them shape their future to self-sustain their security forces. And you start to wonder, am I the most qualified person to do this? And, and am I capable of delivering what this world needs from me? And I share that because you are going to be asked to break trail. And if you take anything away from what I say today, I would ask that it be that. Hashtag break trail. Up to this moment, you have grinded on a path that many have walked before you. You knew the right books to read, you knew the tests to study for, you knew how your professors liked the papers, and maybe which classes you could skip. And now, you'll be given opportunities and some on a well-paved path, but many of you will be faced with the opportunity to break trail, to change the world. Think about that. And I recommend thinking about that in a way of how truly remarkable that opportunity, that gift is to hashtag break trail, to be in the lead position and lead others to the change that you, that we want to see in this world. Now that was my second time in Iraq and much different from the first, which was the ground invasion. And I would argue that both were about contributing peace and stability in this world. And I know you're thinking, did she just say peace? An American soldier built to fight and win our nation's wars? And I did, because most of my service has been to that end, to using that element of national power to bring stability and security to the world. Humanitarian crises, pandemics, hurricanes, earthquakes, or refugee assistance, most of my service has been in that vein. As a matter of fact, that strategic plan was briefed by our now Secretary of Defense to the Prime Minister in the year following my graduation from here. That's the kind of contribution your education provides the world stage. And that is my point about keeping peace, stability, and security, and potentially your call to some type of service that breaks trail. You can't even imagine right now the opportunities and challenges that are going to be asked of you. And in many ways, this degree will immediately place you in positions of leadership. The people that you lead, that you will put first, their families that you will put first, and for some of them, helping them through life struggles that you haven't even experienced yet yourself, and you will do it. We all, all of us, make these decisions as servant leaders. And let me pause for a second. Servant leadership is about working for them, not the other way around. Some people look at a degree or a position like being the president, like I'm the boss, right? But that's not how it works. Servant leadership is you work for the formation. President Linton works for all of you. I don't know if you realize that, right? It's not the other way around. You give back to your organization and we all do it. Micro to macro, right? Some to our families, some to our schools, our communities, our country, state, our county, state. Some cases, our nation, and in some cases, globally. In 2011, I took command of a battalion in Europe focused on deployment to Afghanistan. We were all high-fiving because the Cold War was over and we were sending tanks home. And then in 2015, Crimea had been annexed, and our work to assure our allies and deter Russian aggression required a change of strategy. And once again, I leaned on my education from this institution. I spent most of my time in Eastern Europe to include Ukraine and developed a sustainment strategy for an area of the world that we had little recent experience operating in. I was engaging embassies, senior leaders of states and militaries, and helping shape the security of that region. There was a great deal of bilateral and multilateral work to achieve the same outcome, stability, security, and peace. Kansas State University prepared me for that task. We know that no matter our strength, we will continuously be challenged on a multitude of levels. This is where your Kansas State University education will contribute to de-escalate crises in order to avoid conflict, 
to build partnerships or coalitions, and to identify opportunities to build cooperation in the professional or personal space you choose to hashtag break trail. And finally, I find myself in a new security space, which is science, technology, and the modernization of our force at Army Futures Command. As I sit in the new Silicon Valley and watch the future unfold at the speed of decision, either autonomously or assisted by technology, I am once again reminded of my responsibility with this education to hashtag break trail. And I am much more comfortable, not only because of my experiences, but because I know I am not alone. I have each of you in this fight for a better world. I know I will always have my village. And I offer up to you to keep this network strong, the relationship here with friends, faculty, and myself, I'm always here for you to lean into for mentorship, leadership, or fellowship. Because it's always been about service and sacrifice and a passion for purple. Thank you. Congratulations again. Wasn't that an awesome speech? Thank you, Gemma Alecho. And please accept our thank yous for your service. Please join me now in welcoming Amy Button Wenz, President and CEO of the K State Alumni Association. Thank you. I'm pleased to offer congratulations on behalf of the K-State Alumni Association and more than 200,000 living graduates. If this is your first degree from K-State, we also welcome you into a new relationship with your alma mater. Our mission at the Alumni Association is to lead and inspire lifelong involvement that will benefit Kansas State University and all members of our Wildcat community. Our most important value is LINK. We provide the lifelong link that alumni depend on to remain connected. You can stay in touch through hundreds of alumni activities held on campus, around the country, internationally, and even virtually. Another value is tradition. You will likely celebrate a few traditions this weekend as you sing the alma mater, some of you for the first time as a K-State graduate, or take KSU photos at your favorite location on campus. The final value I'd like to talk about is purple. For K-Staters, it's more than a color. It's a symbol of pride, connection, and family. When you see someone in purple, wearing a K-State class ring, or with a PowerCat license plate on the back of their vehicle, you will feel that sense of family. In recognition of your graduation, the graduate school, along with the K-State Alumni Association, are providing you with a complimentary one-year membership to the association if you are not already a member. K-State alumni are among the most loyal in the nation. Our membership ranks in the top five nationally for the percentage of graduates who are members. That loyalty is shared by generations of K-Staters who have the same passion for K-State that you feel today. We are also pleased to present you with an exclusive alumni lapel pin. We hope you will continue to proudly support K-State and thank you for all you will do for future generations of Wildcats who will follow in your footsteps. Go Cats! President Linton, Provost Tabor, Regent, Regent Kiblingo, faculty and guests, it is now time to introduce to you the graduating class of 2022. We have we have 740 graduate students, out of which 637 masters and 103 doctoral. <laughs> 35 master students self-report as active duty service members or veterans. Six doctoral students self-report as active duty 
service members or veterans. <laughs> 456 identify as females and 284 as males. <laughs> 355 graduate students are from Kansas and 318 are from other places. <laughs> 67 are international students. 67 are international students. <laughs> now age. The youngest master student is 21, and the oldest, most experienced, is 67. <laughs> the youngest doctoral student is 25, and the most experienced is 65. And now travel. The graduate students who travel the furthest to pursue graduate studies at K-State are from Hutton, Sri Lanka, 9,245 miles, and Chennai, India, 8,818 miles. We have an amazing graduating class of 2022. Congratulations to all our graduate students. We are extremely, extremely proud of you. <laughs> Not all students, though, were able to attend this event in person. Therefore, I would like to extend special greetings to the students who could not be here due to their military service or professional obligations. Many of them are participating virtually, as are many family members of our graduates. Thank you for your service, and thank you for joining us virtually. I would like now to ask that you pause for a moment of silence for those who are not with us at all today at today's celebration. Thank you. <laughs> we will now start the conferral of the advanced degrees with the recognition of the Doctor of Philosophy, Doctor of Education, and Master of Fine Art degree candidates. These candidates will advance to the platform to be hooded. We believe that it is appropriate that this final ceremonial honor is performed by the graduate's major professor in recognition of the contributions the faculty member has made in the development of these scholars. Candidates for the Doctor of Philosophy, Doctor of Education, and Master of Fine Art degrees Please rise as you are able and remain standing. Doctoral PhDs. <laughs> President Linton, will you please join me at the podium? On behalf of the world-class graduate faculty of this university, I am pleased to present to you the Doctor of Philosophy, Doctor of Education, and Master of Fine Art degree recipients of the class of 2022. Well, good afternoon. I hope everybody out there is enjoying themselves today. This is a big day. This is a big deal. Congratulations to all of the graduates and to the friends and to the parents. Thank you so much that all you've done to be able to support these graduates over the last several years. And now the best paragraph that you're gonna to hear today. 
by the authority of the people of Kansas and the Kansas Board of Regents, and upon the recommendation of the graduate faculty, I am pleased, I am very pleased to confer Kansas State University degrees upon you, the graduating class of 2022. Advanced degree candidates, you may now be seated. Until the marshal directs you to stand, receive your diploma, and be hooded. Please remember to bring your hood <laughs> and the grad pass to the stage. Professors, please accompany your student to the podium for the hooding ceremony. Associate Dean Bradley Banky will be assisting with the hooding process. Doctor of Philosophy in Agricultural Economics, Wendenise Tikle Mbeya, hooded by Dr. Jason Berktold. <laughs> Eric Kwesi Makafui of 40, Doctor of Philosophy, Agricultural Economics. Gabriela Perez Queseda. Doctor of Philosophy in Agronomy. Robert Elliott Carver. Byron J. Everes. Doctor of Philosophy in Animal Science, Julia Perrine Holen. Doctor of Philosophy in Food Science, Karthik Sajiba Bu. Doctor of Philosophy, Grain Science, Aswiriya Delifun. Kara Michelle Denmeyer. Doctor of Philosophy in Horticulture and Natural Resources, Mu Hong. Kai Jordan Wordle. Doctor of Philosophy in Plant Pathology, Dylan J. Mangle. Nabahadoran Nabat. Doctor of Philosophy in Biochemistry, Mian Huang.
Shin Zhu. Yao Yan. Doctor of Philosophy in Biology, Badida Adekari Dungel. <laughs> Priscilla Amanda Nair Otero. Akash Pandey. Doctor of Philosophy in Chemistry, Vasanta Acharya. Jose Cavarubias Zambrano. Kayla Michelle Jamison Eisleman. Zhang Bo Tong. A Yapan Elangovan. Janaka Chaminda Gamakanda. Gamathiga. Vinu Verges Panikat. Nandini Sakar. Gori Udayagani Kuda Singapuligi. Pratima Pandeya. Kamulambika Mutukumar. Kanchana Probihani Samakun. <laughs> Doctor of Philosophy, Economics, Ten Liu. Doctor of Philosophy in Geography, Hilda Ulomano Oana. Doctor of Philosophy in Mathematics, Jonathan David Remert. Joshua Tyler Stuckey. Doctor of Philosophy in Physics, Narayan Kanka. Krishna Raj Panta.
Doctor of Philosophy and Psychology, Jordan Lee Brandner. Stacy Ann Stoffregan. Doctor of Philosophy and Statistics, Gori Tao Chu. Danfu Yang. Doctor of Philosophy in Adult Learning and Leadership, Patricia Ann Brown. Brandy Colleen Wemp. Doctor of Philosophy in Counseling and Student Development, Tana Marie Arnold. Emily Bethay Johnson. Jenna Lauren Beery. Christy Maria Henderson. Emily Elizabeth Manker. Cassandra Ann Wetzel. Master of Fine Arts, Shea Alexandra Kister. Michael Thomas Burke. Sedepa Bendakshania. Elena Masrer. Doctor of Philosophy in Counseling and Student Development, Dana Renee Dorkdyke. Doctor of Philosophy in Curriculum and Instruction, Kelsey Jo Crabtree. Melissa A. Holmes. Yifan Liao. Doctor of Education, Curriculum and Instruction, Latania Marie Ortega. Leonard Henry Steen II. Doctor of Philosophy in Curriculum and Instruction, Kaylin Julie Hopi.
Doctor of Education in Curriculum and Instruction, Theodore Francis Fabiano. Gwendolyn Suzanne Jacobs. Andrew Lewis Kipp. John Winford Markham IV. Doctor of Philosophy in Curriculum and Instruction, Ana Lucia Mendoza Zarling. Eileen Montalvo Wurzberger. Shinran Wong. <laughs> Olga Elizabeth Minchala Buri. <laughs> Tegan William Nurser. Nathan Howard Bean. Doctor of Philosophy in Biological and Agricultural Engineering, Carrie A. Bigham. Doctor of Philosophy in Chemical Engineering, Niloy Barura. Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, Abdulaziz Hebni Asheri. Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, Majed Omar Al Sandal. Le Lo. -o. Abdemola A. Okarindi. Hui Chen Yang. Safia A. Malala. Joydeep Mitra. Abeola Afolaka Osho. Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, Lauren Edmonds. Doctor of Philosophy in Industrial Engineering, Yu Yang Chen. Halil Tetik. Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, Khalid Mohammed Abdazat. Abdelaziz Mo Abdelaziz. Tyler Bryce Albright. G. 
Chibeng Liu. Abdul Malik Mohammed Al Qatami. <laughs> Doctor of Philosophy in Leadership Communication, Macaulay Thomas Benavides. <laughs> Seya Kokim. Doctor of Philosophy in Human Ecology, Dryden Ray Baumfuck. Carolyn Elise Gimark. Keisha Clark. Paige McAllister. <laughs> Natalia Kuzmina. Doctor of Philosophy in Human Nutrition. Audrey Anima Opuka Shambon. Doctor of Philosophy in Pathobiology, Deepak Kumar. Doctor of Philosophy in Physiology, Ravindra Thakur. Doctor of Education in Community College Leadership, Clarence Y. Madison, Sr. John Ramont. Doctor of Philosophy in Personal Financial Planning, Travis Lee Sholin. So let's say congratulations one more time to each of our doctoral students. It is time now to recognize the master degree candidates. <laughs> Master degree candidates, please rise as you are able and remain standing. President Linton, will you please join me at the podium? On behalf of the world-class graduate faculty of Kansas State University, I am pleased to present the master degree recipients of the class of 2022.
Congratulations, graduates. By the authority of the people of Kansas and the Kansas Board of Regents, and upon the recommendation of the graduate faculty, I am, I am very pleased to confer Kansas State University degrees upon you, the graduating class of 2022. Master degree candidates, you may now be seated until the marshal directs you to line up and pick up your diploma. Please remember to bring your grad pass to the stage. Paige Malin Dortzweiler, Master of Science in Family Studies and Human Services, awarded posthumously. Receiving the award is her husband, Joshua Dortzweiler. Master of Science in Community Development, Sarah Hidalgo Cook. <laughs> Master of Science in Animal Science, Musa Mantari. <laughs> Master of Science in Food Science, Chelsea Joe Shields. Master of Science in Genetics, R William Ryan Schaefer. Master of Agribusiness, Emily Ann Page Garwood. Krista Marie Milton. Allison Jenkins Simpson. Haley Allison Hunt. Corey Scott Friedley. Cynthia Rose Garlic. Shane Patrick Byers. Stephen Charles Whittington II. Jared Robert Dieter. Masters in Agricultural Economics, Luke Samuel Byers. Kinsey Janae Not Cott. John Joseph Green, Master of Science in Horticulture and Natural Resources, Yechi Zhao, Kristen Harrison Taylor, Master of Science in Food Science, Casey Joseph Zimmerman. Master of Science in Animal Science, Roth Quinlan Royal. Andres Fernando Toloso Rusi. Alan J. Warner.
Haley Jo Farmer. Master of Science in Agricultural Education and Communication, Caitlin Elizabeth Hildebrand. Master of Science in Animal Science, Colin Kiliohu Yokiochen. Yashoda Sobedi. Master of Science in Agronomy, Diego Abel Charbonnier Basco. Master of Science in Grain Science, Blake John Plattner. DJ Johnson. Master of Interior Architecture and Product Design, Clayton Arthur Klaus Pfeiffer. Master of Architecture, Jamie Blair List. Sean Michael Reading. Master of Landscape Architecture, Elizabeth Rose Franks. Madison Renee Wolfkuhl. Meredith Jane Bryan. Brian Studer. Master of Arts in Security Studies, Ashley C. Ford. Master in Communication Studies, Laurence Demont Desmond Guider. Master of Arts in English, Joseph Richard Frasco. Spencer Robert Young. Caitlin Ann Rodinich. Sheridan Elizabeth Krolick. Jennifer Marie Trapp. Jordan Marie Shonifer. Molly Morgan James. Hannah Marie Rollison. Mary Cecilia Hoffman. Nissa Owens. Morgan Penny Shiver. Jefferson Albert Storms. Dylan Walker Holt. Master of Arts Sociology, Abigail Grace Weiser. Nicholas Timothy Walref. Master of Arts in Modern Languages, Adam C. Hewitt Smith. Kara Mackenzie O'Day. Jessica Flores Bravo. 
Master of Arts in History, David Patrick Leach. Master of Arts in Theater, Carrie Halloway Wells. Claire Halloway Wells. Kim Lee Wong. Jessica Helene Bilgrade. Alyssa Morgan Fry. Master of Arts in Security Studies, Edward John Dodson. Master of Arts in Economics, Connor Jack Martin. Master in Music, Mary Margaret Dredger. Catherine Elise Westhoven. Michael William Martin. Lorenzo Butler. Mengting Yu. Chen Yu Sun. Natalie Ann Dooling. Master of Science in Mass Communications, Nathan Carl Encero. Piper Noel Brandt. Masters in Biology, Thomas Herrera. Master of Science in Statistics, Alexander James Phillips. Master of Science in Geology, Alyssa Rose Endrich. Alarisa Rustafsada. Brooklyn Drew Armijo. Carrie Lane Brooks. Camden Miller Hatley. William Rexton Jarvis. Olivia Hermine C. Grober. <laughs> Master of Science in Psychology, Lane Matthew Banks. Master of Science in Statistics, Tyler James Bastion. Master of Public Administration, Joshua Robert Haverkamp. Christian Jean Little. Sabrina Marie DeSantis. Taylor Lane Donner. Master of Science in Physics, Kelly Don Runo. Cedric William Weinschenk. Master of Arts in Communication Studies, Raina Elizabeth Kittridge. Master of Science in Personal Financial Planning, Christopher George Rennick.
Master of Science in Mass Communication, Bong Fung Yuan Diet. Professional Science Master in Applied Biosciences, Emily Claire Holkep. Master of Science in Statistics, Pravita Probakar. Master of Business Administration, Sam Neth Roy. Master of Accountancy, Christopher Ray Anderson, Jr. Kylie Ann Durham. Skyler Nicole Wickenhauser. Megan Elizabeth Sample. Alexander Jacob Freto. Master of Business Administration, Lawrence Francis Cahill III. Samuel James Hummer. Ross Everett Elder. Tian Yang Zhu. Levi James West. Perla Oyer. Master of Accountancy, Brittany Paulette Smith. Holly Marie Mills. Rachel Ann Benau. Emma Nicole Hill. Rebecca Jane Knudsen. Mason Ann Seaman. Aaron Rose Goodrum. Shailen Michelle Patachek. Master of Business Administration, Marissa Shinshia Shivers. Cody Lee Sater. Devin Taylor Bratkiv. Chelsea Brianna Fryhart. Kelsey Nicole Flesher. Master of Accountancy, Caitlin Nicole Rose. Osiris Maxwell Manning. Alexa Rose Gehagen. Samantha Marie Hornsby. Nicholas John Gertson. Master of Business Administration, Lorena Melissa Faircloth. Master of Accountancy, Daniel Jacob Erickson. Corey J. Hyman.
Sarah Ann Meenan. Alexis Ann Mosser. Master of Business Administration, James Patrick Darrymple. Logan Hughes. Master of Accountancy, Colin William Holthouse. Trevor Elliott Pogue. Master of Business Administration, Michael Andrew Finch. Tyrus Kelly Grunenwald. Master of Accountancy, Carlos Miguel Pautista Mamuric. Michael Rudy Ware. Ricky Joe Lee. Allison Elizabeth Lyons. Lauren Ann Hummus. Julie Huddleston Rivera. Master of Business Administration, Angela Ellen Chauncey. Brock Davis Putnam. Tyson Michael Rodriguez. Riley J. Marth. Evan Harlan Tustin. Austin James Grippy Graybill. Chelsea Lynn Wardell. Grant Garrett Hill. <laughs> Master of Science in Data Analytics, Casey Michael Keller. Master of Business Administration, Garrett M. Euler. Master of Accountancy, Jeffrey Ethan Torlo. Olivia Grace Steinert. Pedro Beltran. Jacob Henry Bednar. Peyton Michael Graves. Master of Science in Data Analytics, Philip Allen Hustler. Karim Majed. Tendai Munyani. Yelei Yang. Gina M. Russello. Master of Accountancy, Brooklyn Sue Withers.
Master of Science in Data Analytics, Ethan Christopher Schultz. Master of Business Administration, Chi Yun Gu. Master of Science, Data Analytics, Shi Chung Yang. Master of Accountancy, Jack Riley Kennedy. Master of Science in Data Analytics, Nathan Jeffrey Stone. Rajiv Puli. Landry Cornelius Smith IV. Master of Accountancy, Jacob Alexander Campbell. Andrea Nicole Azeltine. Catherine Irene Brown. Master of Science in Data Analytics, Matthew William Coombs. Master of Business Administration, Michael Ryan Spatz. Master of Accountancy, Nancy Lopez Rodriguez. Master of Business Administration, Jeffrey Allen Tizias. Cole Douglas Dister. Master of Science in Data Analytics, Jordan Patrick Martin. Master of Science in Counseling and Student Development, Allison Diane Weimeyer. Caitlin Marie Stream. Isabella Ann Thurl. Megan Lee Hexmeyer. <laughs> Kayla Ann Boltz. <laughs> Megan Nicole Fleming. Frida Torres. Tyler Christian McMahon. Master of Science in Adult Learning and Leadership, Alicia Christine Nans. Master of Science in Academic Advising, Nicole Bedard. Jillian Marisa Terrell. Master of Arts in Teaching, Miranda K. Schumacher. Trevin Reed Edelman. Megan Marie Schuke. James Willard Morrissey Ramsdell. Caitlin Marsha Cannon. Amber Goen. Mary Kathleen Albers.
Michelle D. Barnes. Trevor Jonathan Gray. Kelly Margaret Beerworth. Catherine Hannah Swale. Evelyn Vanessa Lucio Marcias. Isabel Anna Stevens. Mason K. Reeser. Carolyn Scout Holgerson. Master of Science in Special Education, Melinda Sue Huber. Master of Science in Counseling and Student Development, Alexandra Lee Beidler. <laughs> Kelly Collette Wilson. <laughs> Master of Science, Science in Curriculum and Instruction, Reagan Taylor Foos. <laughs> Master of Arts in Teaching, Shauna Lynn Van Winkle. Catherine Lindsay Katz. Jimmy Ann Hembold. Lauren Keller. Master of Science in Special Education, Rachel Eileen Welch. Master of Science in Curriculum and Instruction, Brianne Renee Cruz. Master of Science in Academic Advising, Yvonne Marie Rodriguez Aguillo. Crystal Marie Cadenhead. Trevin Preston McCune. Master of Science in Curriculum and Instruction, Annette Marie Shirley. Master of Science in Academic Advising, Andrea Lynn Sigulski. Master of Science in Counseling and Student Development, Hayden Miles Botkin. Master of Arts in Teaching, Janae Renee Alice Henson. Master of Science in Academic Advising, Lien Tran Lam. Master of Science in Special Education, Mary Frances Cook. Kristen Ray Bedgood. Master of Arts in Teaching, Marie Elizabeth Emming Jones. Kyra Anne Marie Bauman. Jacqueline Michelle Adriano. Catherine Marie Pierce. Christine Michelle Reed. Lori Ann Ramsey.
Jordan Lee Delaney. Michaela Dawn Matthews. Patricia Lynn Keegan. Lisa Jean Taylor. Master of Science in Curriculum and Instruction, Rochelle Ann Annis. Dana Lee Beckett. Christian Kayome Graham. Master of Science in Academic Advising, Caitlin Leanne Burkhead. Master of Arts in Teaching, Jacob J. Kessler. Kristen Marie Hollis. Denise Lynn Nagley. David Lee Bueller. Shane Patrick Newton. Vanessa L. Daniels. Jenna Marie Kimball. Betsy Ann Gilchrist. Laura Nicole Giamanco. Ellen Visto Bragg. Harley Kirsten Russello. Ginny Elizabeth Ellis. Benjamin James Risto. And Adair Johnson Borgmeyer. Lindsay Nicole Petticord. Maritza Alvarez. Bianca Liliana Gasca. Master in Education, Corinne Marie Simmons. Master of Science in Adult Learning and Leadership, Barbara J. Wells. Master of Arts in Teaching, Julie Ann Heinking. Lynn Ann Crawley. Ian Anthony Hodges. Anika Hesse. Sarah Mariantha Bacado. Master of Science in Counseling and Student Development, Emily Rose McLaughlin. <laughs> Michaela Sue Pullen. <laughs> 
Samantha Jo Garrett. Zachary Joseph Atkins. Skyler Ty Hembry. Leah Marie Fields. Madeline Ann Knack. Courtney Elizabeth Taylor. Benedict Robert Dorweiler. Dylan Chase Richardson. Nathaniel Ruben Armenta. Master of Arts in Teaching, Ariel Nicole Blanton. Krista Noel Johnson Bird. Trista Elise Gorel. Tracy Nicole Teemeyer. Caitlin M. Gloover. Chia Ching Wu. Kira Pullum. Adriana E. Minotti. Chelsea Marie Hightower. Evan Daniel Shanelek. Master in Academic Advising, Eric Richard Warden. Master of Arts in Teaching, Olivia Madison Meadows. Ashley Nicole Parton. Karen Elizabeth McWillam. Kelly Kathleen Madison. Brooke Bading Fleener. Shanda Preston. Evangeline D. Korenke. Amy Lynn Whitlock. Lindsay Morgan Dunikak. Peyton Matthew Neufeld. Master of Science in Special Education, Delaney Don Taylor. Master of Arts in Teaching, Anna Marie Kim. Britta Elizabeth Pischer. Jennifer Lynn Beischel. Ashley Arias Garcia.
Kristen Elizabeth Blum. William Eugene Fry. Isabella Rose Vardaman. Andrea Lorraine Cole. Allison Jean Laskowski. Master of Science in Adult Learning and Leadership, Luke Crispin Bay. Megan Kindle Bircher. Kimberly Arthur Maxwell. Elizabeth Ann Diavola. Brandy Nicole Nowak. Brittany Castleberry Swoboda. Amy Lee Olson. Julia Catalina Ramos. Amanda Michelle Davis. Yosdel Ibarra Espinosa. Donna Alawandi. Master of Science in Mechanical Engineering, Dong Huen Kim. Master of Science in Electrical and Computer Engineering, James David Leonard II. Master of Science in Operations Research, Alexander D. Dundas. Master of Science in Electrical and Computer Engineering, Colton Strickler. Master of Science in Computer Science, Ryan Patrick Hennessy. Master of Science in Civil Engineering, Emily Michelle Randig. Master of Science in Industrial Engineering, Andrew Cole Hudson. Dakota Lee Angel. Master of Science in Architectural Engineering, Chelsea Lynn Lewis. Master of Science in Civil Engineering, Seth David Henserling. <laughs> Master of Science in Architectural Engineering, Gabriela Faith Radna. Dawson Thomas Bailey. Master of Science in Civil Engineering, Ryan Christopher Rogowski. Jeremy Brandon Hansen. Master of Science in Operations Research, Daniel James Lukowski. Master of Science in Personal Financial Planning, Nicholas David Tupai. Joshua Nuth. Master of Science in Computer Science, Divya Vani Lacaredi. <laughs> Master of 
Say Sandeep Dasari. Master of Science in Mechanical Engineering, Budika Lakmal Anthanayaka. Master of Science in Nuclear Engineering, Daniel Lewis Patrick Watson. Master of Science in Kinesiology, Nathaniel Ernst. Brian K. Bramwell. Master of Science in Family Studies and Human Services, Rachel Ann Forrester. Sarah Nicole Yos. Master of Science in Personal Financial Planning, Jacqueline Cummings Koski. Jeb M. Flynn. Darren Hines. Sabina Smelhodzik Lewis. Master of Science in Apparel and Textiles, Nedishani Nechithana Ranayaka. Master of Science in Hospitality Administration, Xinyu Zheng. Master of Science, Nutrition, Dietetics, and Sensory Sciences, Alyssa Nicole Towsley. Master of Science, Family Studies and Human Services, and Joe Pitts. Georgiana Finesse Hundley. Dana Joe Vincent. Molly Claire McLean. Sydney Marie Zafran. Mallory Maritha Verdi. Riley Michelle Houston. Carly Nicole Erickson. JC Ann Brogan. Sydney Lynn Pater. Olivia Pauline McKinney. Madison Lynn Bowers. Madis Master of Science, Nutrition, Dietetics, and Sensory Sciences, Addison Elizabeth Arner. Master of Science, Kinesiology, Ashley Michelle James. Master of Science in Nutrition, Dietetics, and Sensory Sciences, Elena Ainsko. Master of Science in Personal Financial Planning, David Scott Feldmeyer, Jr. Thomas Burling Grant, Jr. Jared Lee Jansen.
Jeanette Lynn Beatty. Master of Science in Gerontology, Lambra Denise Holloway. Master of Science in Personal Financial Planning, Haley Pamela Haslett. Master of Science in Family Studies and Human Service, Adelaide Delaney Klutz, Klutzi. Latiera Jurgen. Master of Science in Hospitality Administration, Riley Elizabeth Falk. Master of Science in Kinesiology, Autumn Homan. Master of Public Health, Milena Mariah Webb. Anna Marie Biggins. Cheyenne Nicole Brunkow. Delshe Patrice Roberts. Sarah Jessica Ochoa Sanchez. Lindsay Michelle Mason. Master of Science, Veterinary Biomedical Science, Sarah Elizabeth Wilson. Reagan Elise Allen. Jamie Lynn Williams. Madison Kate Ponte. Holly Ann Broadbent. Ryan Leanne Allison. Rebecca Lynn Herzog. Emily Faye Grant. Laney Ann Bailey Schrutfinger. Shiloh Marie Marchand. Cheyenne Autumn Knox. Hector Anthony Rojas. Jerusa Mercedes Matthews. Emily Elizabeth Robinette. Astrid Diana Carcamo Stick. Whitney Jessica Woods. Abigail L. Huber. Mia J. Kim. Unji Kim.
Tyler Mariah Stiggers. Brandy Joanne Fian. Brigadier General Michelle Lecter, Master of Arts in National Security and Strategic Studies. Wow, wasn't that impressive? <laughs> Congratulations to each of our advanced degrees graduates. I welcome you to the community of scholars as Kansas State University alumni. We hope each of you will stay engaged with Kansas State University, will seek opportunities to serve as mentors to students, will keep your mentor, and the graduate school updated on your successes, and that you will spread the word about the high quality of K-State's graduate programs. We wish you all the best as you go out into the world and make your unique mark. And we cannot wait to see what you accomplish next. Please join me in recognizing one more time the Kansas State University Advanced Degree Recipient of 2022. <laughs> you are all awesome. <laughs> I would like to take this final opportunity to express my appreciation for all who have contributed to the success of today's ceremony. I want to thank the marshals, the members of the graduate school team, the staff in the communication and marketing, the commencement organizers, the staff in the provost office, who all have worked very hard for the orderly conduct of this ceremony. Above all, on behalf of the faculty, I want to thank you, graduates for sharing such an important part of your lives with us. We have arrived now at the closing moments of today's ceremony. After the singing of the Alma Mater, to safely con conclude this ceremony, we ask that the graduates remain seated until the platform party has exited the stage. Please follow the directions of the marshals to a safe exit. We also ask the audience to remain seated until the graduates, faculty, and the platform party have made their way to the concourse. Now, please stand for the alma mater as we close the 2022 Graduate Schools Commencement Ceremony. Thank you, and all have a great day.